Hi, I've used this uh, digital substance honeycomb uh, VB and what I've done is I've stretched hexagons over um, you remember my old hairnet thing that I did before. It's, it's the wrong surface to it's the wrong inflated surface shape but um, from those hexagons I've put circles in the middle and cut out uh, an underside. Um, I'll show you here what I've done. So I've put these circles in and on the circles where they intersect, actually it's not displaying just like that, but what I've got is these lofted catenaries. Some of them aren't just quite right. I see there's a problem with a few of them there. I hadn't spotted that before. Um, guess the mathematics of this ain't quite right, so if I should be able to spin these round. If what the idea is that as you've got this um, mesh section here, these central parts should weather cock, riding the rails around in the circles in here, and you'll be able to create a standard uh, repeating pattern in order to make this mesh set. Now this isn't a square that I'm flying. Uh, it would be better if I was flying, uh, flying more standard shape for the X division um, in order to improve that. Yeah. See, I'm spinning them around a wee bit there. It's very slow to react because of the size of the model. But uh, as an idea, you could also, where you've got these lines, um, tethering the whole thing, if they were tethered around about in you know, a more circular fashion, as much hexagons, it would get a better result. And the upwind tethers, you would want to release further so that the upwind side overall was pointing up the right kind of direction. But you can see there the whole well, idea sort of sort of works so that the whole overall general shape would be lifting. Now, as for launching, it'd be best to, if you had something like this, to launch a central section first. So say these were fairly massive, launch the central one, then bring in onto another anchor field around about this first anchor field, this set of six, launch those with uh, attaching to this central one and those would be our anchors the outside of that one then again next layer around that's around that six you'd have the set around there launch those launch those launch those until you'd have you know the, your original one at the very top and your stack launched around about with tethering on each of these uh, outer points possibility what do you reckon